All right, here we go. This round three of the Road Wars 2004 tournament. We got Chip, Suicidal Tendencies, Killer Carrot, and Grave Digger. Oh, man. Chip's already making some big damage to Grave Digger there. Series 4 Grave Digger, to be specific. After this, we'll have the round of 16, I think it'll be, where we're gonna have to, where I'm gonna have to pick some uh, wild cards after these group battles. And it, uh, after the, after round three, by the way, like once we get to round four, which is gonna be the round of 16, that's when we're going one on one finally, because we'll have narrowed it, we've narrowed it down enough where we can get away with that without it taking 50 years. Oh, Chips trying to rip away at two times since he's killer carrots. Oh, Grave Digger's done. Grave Digger's done. Suicide and Tendencies is having a bad time right now. Chip is tearing away at them. All right, Killer Carrot's coming over. There goes one of the tracks on Suicidal Tendencies. And now Chip coming on the other side of Killer Carrot. Oh, my God. If that other track gets ripped off, then it's game set and match for Suicidal Tendencies. Oh, nice flip there by Killer Carrot. Trying to get rid of Chip right now. Oh, nice flip on Suicidal Tendencies again. Suicidal Tendencies is taking some nasty damage in this fight. Oh, and there they go. It's between Killer Carrot and Chip now. Killer Carrot could throw Chip out, but Chip could also do enough damage to Killer Carrot to prevent Killer Carrot from winning. Oh, Killer Carrot. Got Chip near the wall. Some nice juggling from Killer Carrot at the moment. Oh, up against the wall. Look at this. Oh, it's very close now. Okay, is this going to be it for Chip? I think it is. They're not going to be able to move. And it's going to be it. There they go. Killer Carrot wins. Chip is, well, potentially out. Keep in mind that we are going to be picking some wild cards, so Chip, Suicidal Tendencies, and Gravedigger still have a chance of getting back into the fight. Three spinners and one flipper in this one. We've got Spin Doctor US, Humbug, Ripper, and the very scary Twister right now. Oh, man. So all of these robots are scary in their own ways, really. Humbug is just persistent, really. Twister's got the more powerful weapon, and Spin Doctor can usually trick the AI... Oh, maybe not this time, though. Ripper, of course, is able to get under opponents, and obviously, as a flipper, it'll be able to throw robots out and about. Spin Doctor's lost its weapon. Twister's already laying waste to the opposition at the moment. The oh! Oh, my God. Okay, so two spinners have lost their weapons, big thanks to Twister. So Spin Doctor, its strategy's not going to work this time, and that's going to allow Ripper to flip them about here. Oh, man. All saying that, Ripper's maybe made a mistake. Oh. You can see Spin Doctor trying to just hold Ripper off here by getting around the sides. Like it normally would with the spinner. Oh, but no luck there. Okay. A nice little pin there by Ripper. Oh, Humbug's making his way over now to join in. Twister's coming over. Humbug's in a bad way right now. Oh, man. Oh, yeah, Humbug's not lasting much longer at this rate. Oh, nice flip there. Spin Doctor's getting flipped about by Ripper once again. Oh. Pushing Twister into the wall, and Spin Doctor's getting pushed into the wall. Oh, man. Two pins going on right now. Okay, Ripper's backing up. Spin Doctor, a little bit of apprehensive. Oh, it's looking like it's the end. Yep, it's the end for Humbug. And I don't fancy Spin Doctor's chances. Oh, but Twister getting thrown there by Ripper. Oh, nice shot in on the back there. And again. And again. Oh, Ripper's got to do something. It can't keep taking damage like this. 
Oh, Ripper's going to get knocked out at this rate. Okay, pushing Twister now. Oh, God, that's a very bad way of dealing with Twister. Now you got Spin Doctor pinning Twi Ripper and letting Twister get in under the flipper again. Oh, my God. And the final countdown begins. And I think it's safe to say that your winner is Twister. Now it's time for Shunt, M2, Cassius, and Lightning Fast. Nice work there. Oh, so we got some very dangerous robots here. Oh, Shunt's been flipped. Shunt's been flipped. Oh, but they're back. Lightning Fast is in trouble right now. Nice flip there by M2, but M2's also getting ducked. Cassius has flipped Shunt, and M2 has flung out Lightning Fast. Oh, Cassius now taking a beating from Shunt right now. And there goes Cassius. M2's now next up on the chopping block. And... Oh, my God. M2's in trouble. Is Shunt going to leave it like this? I think so. Shunt is moving on to the round of 16. All right, here we go. Grim Reaper, Raging Nightmare, U2, and UFO. Ooh, a bit of a stalemate, but don't worry. Two more flippers are coming in. Oh, well, Raging Nightmare is not quite coming into the battle just yet. Here we go. In comes Raging Nightmare. Nice flip to U2 to start us off. Oh, Grim Reaper getting Raging Nightmare. And it's looking bad for Raging Nightmare at the moment, Grim Reaper. So far, Raging Nightmare is the only... Well, Raging Nightmare is the only one that still has two uh, robots in. Like, Raging Nightmare and Raging Nightmare Series 7 are both still in the competition. Raging Nightmare is done. u is looking to be in trouble. Oh, nice flip there. Oh, man. UFO could be in trouble. Some serious, serious trouble. Oh, UFO nearly flipped itself out there. But it's safe. It's managed to survive. None of these robots have, like, the greatest ground clearance. So it is a bit of a game here trying to see who will get under the other. Oh. Raging Nightmare from the offset would have had the obvious advantage there, ground clearance-wise. But things just did not pan out for it. Oh. You can see U2 and UFO trying to get under Grim Reaper here. <laughs> right off of this, like I said, we're going to be seeing Grim Reaper Series 7 Edition. So, like, just because one Grim Reaper's going out, doesn't, you know, there's still a chance of a Grim Reaper going the distance here. Oh, there's also a chance both get eliminated in the same round, though. We, genuinely, it's that hard to say. Oh... Oh, man. Oh, there we go. UFO's in trouble again. UFO trying to recover. Oh, U2 caught between a rock and a hard place. Ooh. Oh, God. Grim Reaper. Oh, UFO. Both. Oh, UFO could be in trouble. Come on. Oh, no, no, no. This is very weirdly close right now. The AI just doesn't know where to go right now. It's a bit of a weird stalemate between these three. Which is causing them to keep switching places. So there's no, like, guarantee on who's going to go after who right now. What's well, the final 10 seconds heading into this one? Or oh, UFO... Nearly made a big mistake there, but it's going to make the full three minutes, but I think I'm going to give that to the Grim Reaper. Grim Reaper's really difficult to take out, it seems. All right, here we go. We have Grim Reaper, Beckatron, Spawn Again, and Axel. Out of all the Iron Ore robots, Axel's the only one of those left. We have two Grim Reapers still in competition, and Beckatron's the last of the video game robots that are still in the competition. Although it may need not for much longer. 
Oh, the pit's been opened. Beckatron can't do anything if flipped over, so this is probably the end for Beckatron. Because Born Again's going to back away the moment the countdown starts. Yep, there we go. That's going to be it for Beckatron. Well, assuming it doesn't get a wild card anyway, that'll be it. Oh, Grim Reaper there. Nice work. Spawn again. Turns around. And a big flip there. Oh, man. There. Oh, Axor's still in it. And now it's gone. <laughs> it's between the Grim Reaper and Spawn again now. Oh, man. They're in a bit of a stalemate. Once the countdown starts, they'll start backing away from each other. Or are they? No. Oh my god. Spawn again. Look at that. Oh, that's controversial. But Spawn again wins. Right, so I've already decided who the three wildcards are going to be. It's going to be Chip. The Grim Reaper Series 7. Because as much as I know some people are going to be like, No, there's two Grim Reapers in the series. Or like the... Series of eight or whatever. I just realized that's a round of eight, not round of six. Anyway, point is... Uh, it's going to be uh, Chip, Grim Reaper Series 7, and Cassius. Because Cassius' performance up until now has been stellar. So I want to give Cassius another chance. Also, I realize it's not the round of 16 up next. It's the round of eight, but let's jump into it. All right, it's time for the round of eight. I think we're actually going to end up finishing this up to be honest with you now that i look at it i think we're gonna be finishing it up today so these are the finals really here we go killer carrot 2 versus twister we're in the round of eight yeah like i said i got it wrong it's not the round of 16 it's the round of eight we finally we and we are ending it on today's episode i thought this was gonna be a two two like i thought there was gonna be one more video after this but no we are gonna finish it off today Oh, Twister, as powerful as it is, might be getting thrown out. Also, with no more wild cards after this, so Twister's gone for good now. Thrown out by Killer Carrot 2 in record time. Now it's time for Shunt versus the Grim Reaper. Could this be the time where the Grim Reaper falls, or will Shunt be taken out? Remember, again, there's no more second chances. That was the one and only time the wild cards are showing up in this tournament. Ooh, a nice pin there by Shunt. Are we getting another M2 situation? No, Shunt backs away. Oh my god, the flip is getting broken. The flip is getting broken. Oh my god. Is Grim Reaper okay? Oh, the flip is completely busted, I just realized. Oh, this is looking bad for Grim Reaper right now. Oh man. Oh, lift up with a scoop. Oh, Shunt's, Shunt is merciless in this. Oh, my God. Look at that. The power of Shunt right now. Shunt can be taken out, but it's just no robot has managed to do it just yet. Oh, Grim Reaper, though. I think it's looking to be the end for Grim Reaper. Oh. How much more can Grim Reaper take, realistically? Big shots there. Another big shot. And... That is going to do it. Shunt wins. Shunt is moving on to the semi-finals. All right. Spawn again versus Chip now. Chip being one of the wild cards. Gets another chance. Will they be able to make the most of it? Or is Spawn again going to make sh make them wish they hadn't spawned again? Ooh. It's a bit dicey for Chip, admittedly. The ground clearance difference there. Spawn's getting them to the wall. And that's going to be the end for Chip. Man, wild cards have a bad time in these tournaments, don't they? All right, here we go. We got a Series 7 machine versus a Series 2 machine. It's Cassius versus the Grim Reaper. And Cassius has gone on the Grim Reaper. Could this be the end for the Grim Reaper already? Now we've seen Cassius take out one Series 7 machine before when they eliminated Typhoon 2. But Grim Reaper 
as we saw up until now, there were, it managed to last with two of them. Oh, okay, this could be bad. This could be very bad for Cassius right now. Oh, Cassius managed to self-ride. That's good. But they need to bounce back here because Grim Reaper... Oh, no, towards the wall. Oh, man. Is Cassius in trouble? No, no, the flipper's going to get back eventually. Oh, no. Cassius! They fired the flipper at the wrong time! Grim Reaper's hanging on. Cassius is eliminated. All right, here we go. It's time for Killer Carrot 2 versus Shunt starting the semi-finals. Oh, gosh. Oh, Killer Carrot's gone under Shunt. Can they flip Shunt over? Oh. They're trying, bless them. Look at this. And they've done it. They've tipped Shunt over. Oh, no, they've tipped Shunt back, though. But there, the arena floor flipper. Oh, gosh. Okay, Killer Carrot trying to self-ride there. There we go. Oh, God. Oh, Shunt's back again. Oh, this is getting dicey now. Oh, the floor flipper. Shunt! Oh, my God. Killer Carrot keeps tipping Shunt over. And Shunt's back on its feet again. Oh, there goes the rest of the flipper. Oh, no. Oh, Killer Carrot was doing so well. You've got to be kidding me. Oh. Oh, yeah. Killer Carrot's not going to make it. Killer Carrot's going to be going to the third place playoffs for sure. Oh, that is nasty stuff there. It might have been a mistake putting Shunt in this tournament. Oh, well. Oh, look at this. And now backing away. Killer Carrot. You can see them trying, but there's not much they can do at this stage. As Shunt picks away at them. Oh, my God. Killer Carrot's a little dazed. Oh, God. More damage being done again. Oh, man. 45 seconds to go. I think the most Killer Carrot can hope is somehow make it the, fi the final 45, 40 seconds. Oh, it's not happening, though, is it? Look at this. Oh, wait a minute. The arena flipper? No, no. And... Shunt's going to the grand final. All right. Spawn again versus Grim Reaper, Series 7. Two big flippers. Grim Reaper's got an under. And a nice flip there. Oh, Spawn again's trying to recover, but Grim Reaper keeps pushing them towards the wall. Oh, Spawn again recovers. Just to get flipped again by Grim Reaper. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oh, not quite. Spawn again. Oh, they have an opportunity here if they can just get under Grim Reaper. I swear, if you get locked like this, two and a half minutes, I was going to say, please don't get locked like that. Oh, to the wall. Grim Reaper. They might not get to recover. Oh, my God. Oh. Oh, God, this is getting... Oh, it's Grim Reaper's turn now. Gosh. Oh my god, this is getting tense here. Okay, now we might... Oh! Oh my god! Okay, Grim Reaper's in trouble because it pushed towards the wall. A big flip. Another one. And... Oh, it's still in. It's still in. And it's... Oh! No! It's still in. Grim Reaper's somehow still in this fight. Oh, but Spawn again is relentless right now. One wrong flip and it's all over. Oh, Grim Reaper trying to bounce back. But Spawn again with the flips. But Grim Reaper now under this time. 
and Grim Reaper will be facing Shun in the grand final. But before that, it's Spawn again versus Killer Carrot in our third place playoff. Here we go, third place playoff. Killer Carrot 2 versus Spawn again. Who will be getting the who will be getting third place in this? Oh, Killer Carrot might be in trouble. Spawn again, inching closer to the wall. Oh my god. Oh, this is dangerous. This is a dangerous situation. Killer Carrot getting juggled by Spawn again. And third place goes to Spawn again. All right, it's time for the grand final. Grim Reaper, Series 7, takes on Shunt. And a big flip there, tips them over. Oh, Shunt trying to self-right. Grim Reaper with another big flip. Keeping on top of Shun here, keeping them on the back foot. Pushing them towards the wall. Oh, Shunt. Oh, the pit button's been, been activated. Oh, wait a minute. The Grim Reaper might be about to leave Shunt alone to get counted out. And there's a big shocker there. Grim Reaper's done it. Shun's going to get second, and Grim Reaper Series 7 wins this ridiculously long tournament. Oh my god. Well, I want to thank you so, so much for watching this. This was a lot of fun, um, and it was crazy as well. Lots of twists and turns, but here is our final four. Fourth place um, goes to Killer Carrot. Third place, Spawn again. Second place, Shunt. Oh, man. And first place, of course, goes to the Grim Reaper Series 7. The Grim Reaper designs lasted a long time before either one of them would get eliminated. So that's pretty impressive, honestly. I'm pretty sure Grim Reaper Series 7 is act was actually a wild card as well. So, like, it got very lucky. If it did get that wild... If I didn't give it that wild card and I gave it to, like, M2 or something, who knows what would have happened. Oh, there goes Shunt. Finally, they're starting to show that Shunt can be beaten. It's about time. Anyway, I want to thank you so much for watching. If you did enjoy, please be sure to show your support by leaving a like on the video. Comment down below what you thought of the tournament. Subscribe and hit that notification bell to be notified of future videos on the channel. And if you want to know the biggest way of supporting the channel, if you can, please consider hitting that join button and or don making a donation. If you, you, know, you don't have to if you can't, but that's the biggest way of supporting the channel. If you become a member, you get access to custom emotes and members-only videos. Um, members should have gotten a little sneak peek of this tournament uh, early in advance, actually. So you know little benefits anyway i want to thank you so much once again for tuning in i truly appreciate the people who tuned in whether they just found out about this tournament or if they've been watching since the beginning um regardless thank you all so much and i'll see you all next time with the next uh big old video game robot tournament bye guys